And hey, Piscean. I hope you guys are doing well today. So let's tap into your energy. Let's see what's going on with my <clears throat> beautiful and my handsome Pisces. Sorry, guys, about my throat in advance. My son gave me just a little cold or something. So <clears throat> excuse my throat. But let's tap in, Pisces. Let's see what's going on with you all. All righty. Okay. Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses. Please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm Pisces and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones, return it back to the sender. Block any interferences that could be stopping the message from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages from my Pisceans. <clears throat> and protect me as I channel the messages for Pisces. Somebody here could want to take a trip to see you. Somebody just want to pop up out the blue and reach out and be like, yeah, I want to come see you or whatever. And this could be in the midst of new doors opening up for you. So you could be having rocky emotions about this. Like, you don't know if you want to take it or not. I feel like whoever this is, they didn't ghost your ass. <laughs> and now they're popping up. Oh, yeah, I want to see you. I feel like it's a fuck no. I feel like you need to be saying no. Then we have female spine and gold digger. So this woman... Whoever this bitch is right here, they're watching this person try to come be with you. No. The answer is no. 11.33 on the clock. You guys can be seeing those synchronicities. Divine payout. Exactly. Yeah, I feel like you could be going into your Ten of Pentacles already. <laughs> you guys could be seeing 10-10. What's, the, what's this for Pisces? Yeah, we got jealousy here. We got peace and happiness and new love cycle. Exactly. Somebody here is jealous. What else? Never understands. So confusion. What else? Social media junkie. So somebody is watching you online. Oh, you bitches stay on social media watching somebody, boy. I'm telling you, yeah, in the fields, not feeling so well. Working together and brick wall. So I feel like somebody is blocked, okay? Some of you guys could be working together with somebody and whoever this is right here that's trying to get into your energy, they're blocked, okay? Now somebody's in their feelings and they don't feel too well. Somebody's crying a lot or, I don't know. <clears throat> yeah, vacation and divine feminine. Yeah, you could be, <laughs> you're going on a trip, divine feminine. Or somebody feels like you're a vacation. They want to come see you. They want to get away from somebody here that's jealous or just ridiculous. I feel like they're jealous of you. And that's the problem. <clears throat> Whoever this is, they got this third party. They need to stay the fuck away from you. Somebody here don't give a fuck. And that's what I don't like about this person. They're really inconsiderate. They don't give a fuck about what nobody else is doing. They just want to come to you and run to you when they're tired of this bitch. I feel like, bitch, you are fucking rude. <laughs> you are rude and inconsiderate. Stay your stupid ass over there with this hoe. I'm sick of seeing that ass pop out with this fucking third party. I really am. It's like redundant. Yeah, page of swords. Somebody just stay watching you. Every day, all fucking day. Just watching, 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 stalking. They ask to be married. It's just like, bitch. Mm -mm -mm. What's this jealousy here? Five of swords in reverse. Yeah, queen of cups in reverse. So somebody here is, is retaliating. I feel like somebody feels embarrassed or ashamed or they feel defeated like they have to walk away. But I feel like with this jealousy and the five of swords in reverse, somebody's like being... They're, they're being spiteful, revengeful. Okay, what's jealousy with the five of swords reverse? Yeah, six of swords in reverse. <laughs> mm -mm. Aquarius, Mercury, Aquarius, Venus. I feel like when these hoes get into an argument, 
and somebody here come running to you or somebody brings you up all the time or whatever this is, man, this is just dumb. <clears throat> Hmm. Yeah, so this is like um trouble headed trouble headed your way here. Sorry, I was looking at text. Trouble headed this person's way. I feel like this is this person trying to run away from something. Whoever this is is just so somebody here just don't know how to deal with their own problems. <clears throat> They really don't. What's the five of swords in the reverse? Yeah, the moon reverse. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Because something is coming out. Something has been revealed with the moon reverse. What's the five of swords reverse with the moon reverse? Cancer Pisces. Okay, the lovers. <clears throat> the five of pentacles. And the nine of pentacles. So I feel like with the Nine of Pentacles, yeah, you're free from something. You've left, some, you've left somebody out in the cold with the Nine of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles. Or somebody's like leaving somebody out in the cold for you. But I feel like you're leaving something out in the cold to be either alone or you're going into another divine connection. Somebody here, maybe this is what somebody is realizing. Maybe somebody is seeing that you're already intertwined with something or you're already with somebody here. And they're like, oh, yeah, well, let me try to come ruin that or whatever the fuck this is. <clears throat> the moon reverses you moving away from any fear and anxiety or stress. I feel like, you know, you're good. You ain't worried about no damn body. The lovers is, I feel like there's a union here, a partnership, or this is just balanced energy. This could be family values and morals aligning. Yeah, two of cups. In the ace of wands. Yeah, you're interested in, in someone. I feel like you're wealthy, you're free, you're abundant. This is just like you moving with grace. I feel like you leave people behind with grace. It's like, oh, okay, well, you want to do what you're doing, so let me move on. I feel like you're not even bothering nobody. And somebody here feels jealous or they want to retaliate or whatever the fuck this is. I feel like really somebody feels embarrassment or they feel, they feel ashamed. <laughs> they feel dumb. What's the six of swords in the reverse? <laughs> You guys should be saying 666. We got the Six of Cups reverse, the Ace of Swords in reverse. Mm. So something here definitely didn't work. There will be no damn breakthrough. This could be somebody here with secret animosity or just somebody got a secret problem with your ass here. This could be a lot of arguing or fighting going on somewhere. <laughs> mm. There will be no breakthrough though. Somebody here made the wrong decision. Now I feel like they ass is stuck to be honest and they're just going through it. It's like there, there will be no peace and calm waters. Somebody's going through a problem. Oh well. And you over here loving up on your man or your woman. Like you're happy as fuck. <laughs> Excuse me. There's arguments because somebody has not let go of their past. Somebody here lied about letting go of their past. The truth the truth has came out about the fact that you really released somebody and the fact that somebody here has uh, animosity towards you. So now I feel like there could be people arguing with somebody else, with this person that started this mess. Is what I'm getting. <clears throat> because what's the Ace of Swords in reverse? Yeah, something is chaotic. It's out of control. Somebody bit off more than they can chew in this situation. So now I feel like there's secret animosity or there's there's conflict going on somewhere. There's a lot of arguing or fighting going on, child. <laughs> What's the Ace of Swords in reverse to a Pentacles reverse? Yeah, the Fool reverse and the Empress. Or somebody is trying to get away from someone that they're with. They keep arguing and fighting with this bitch over here, whoever the fuck this is, <clears throat> that's jealous of you. 
And I heard somebody say, well, since you're so jealous, I'm just going to go be with the person that you're jealous of. I feel like, bitch, no the fuck you're not. <laughs> no, you're not. No, you're not. You need to go handle that. Leave this person the fuck alone. Don't nobody want to deal with you and your fucking drama. Get the fuck on somewhere. Facts. Somebody, the fool in reverse is a distraction or somebody's mad that somebody keeps getting distracted. I feel like you're aware that something was a distraction to you, so you're leaving it behind. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Something here has gotten messy or out of control. Or maybe it's a third party that realizes like, oh, yeah, well, I'm just a rebound. I'm a distraction. I've, I've been used to get over. Because for some of you, you could be somebody's child's mother or child's father. And your ex is like trying to get over you by going to be with other hoes. And I feel like these hoes are finding out like, yeah, they don't really mean nothing to this person. One or the other. So now trouble is hating somebody. Well, I feel like Six of Swords in the reverse is you standing your ground too. You're not tripping. You're handling something with grace. You done moved on with your life. And the Empress is you um, being the Empress. Swords, Libra energy. Just period. So like you didn't, you've grown. You feel confident. You're mature. You're moving on with your damn life. And you're protected or you're protecting your damn self. This could be expected trouble, like the nine of, nine of wands here, you feel guarded or you feel the need to de defend yourself or protect yourself because there could be somebody, um, a sudden arrival of something like, or something like that. You guys would be saying nine, 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 or this is somebody else's ass. What's the six of cups in the reverse? Somebody has a rose tinted view of the past. Yeah, the queen of cups in the reverse. <sighs> yeah. <clears throat> What's Six of Cups reverse, Queen of Cups reverse? Somebody was distracted. And now I feel like you view somebody as a distraction. You don't want to be bothered. Ten of Pentacles in a reverse with the Queen of Cups reverse. Yeah, this is... This Queen of Cups in reverse is very spiteful. They're very vindictive. They're needy. They're clingy. They whine a lot. They nag a lot. Somebody here is just... But whoever this is, though, is really naive. They're gullible. Either this Queen of Cups is or whoever this is that's still tripping about you is. They keep on getting themselves involved in karmic connections with karmic hoes. They can't do shit for them. They can't do shit for them either. It's just like a mess. <clears throat> very insecure and just all over the place. Very emotionally unstable. There's fights and shit about money. There's instability here. They're losing everything. <laughs> For some of you, this could be you where you've, maybe you've chased love in the past, Queen of Cups in reverse. This could be you, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like um, somebody likes when you're, when you're gullible or naive or whatever. I feel like somebody feels like because you don't fight back or you don't do all that, that you're weak. 11.44 on the clock. I feel like, bitch, you know, somebody got shit to lose, unlike you. <laughs> Ain't nobody fighting with you about no bitch or fighting with you about anything, really. Unless you, unless you put your hands on this person, I'm pretty sure they can beat your ass. So I feel like you hoes know better than to do that. But ain't nobody finna sit back and argue with you or fight with you about shit. We're moving the fuck on and focusing on our bag and cultivating better connections and relationships. Nobody's gonna fight with you hoes about no weak ass man or no weak ass bitch. Nobody's doing that. Just period. So if that's what somebody was expecting, I feel like no. You expect it wrong, bitch. You shouldn't be expecting no shit like that anyways. <clears throat> so yeah. I feel like something is just over. Something is just breaking up. It's just a mess. Maybe somebody was with this person. They, they, this person. I don't know. It's just a lot of jealousy and insecurities here about you, Empress, man or woman. Mm -hmm. Oh well. What's the never understands? The judgments. What's never understands here with the judgment? The two of cups. What somebody don't understand? The fact that you're in love with somebody? Yeah, this is you going through an awakening or definitely a past life soulmate here. You've learned the karmic lessons that you needed to learn and now you're in the two of cups. You're in love. You've, you've got a better relationship or you're now the empress. You've grown, you've matured, you're confident. So you're just sitting back receiving your blessings like you're good. All you had to do was free yourself from this shit. Somebody couldn't choose or they put you in a third party. I feel like that's the secret that's coming out. Now they're embarrassed or ashamed. I feel like, bitch, what? So you freed yourself from this and you've become the empress. You've grown, you've matured, you did what you needed to do. So yeah, I feel like um, this is you having a sense of awareness. This is you making the right decision, you being decisive. You know where you want to go. You know where you want to be at. Yeah, with your damn emperor and the center cups. 
it was fated for you to walk away from something or somebody like what's the judgment yeah the world a brand new beginning that's celebratory this is wholeness it's completion you learned the karmic lessons you needed to learn and you're going into your ten of cups yeah this is a union here four of wands for sure a very strong union yeah what's the judgment here with the world yeah seven of wands something is protected is blocked or you've learned how to stand up for yourself or stand up for what you believe in yeah, something was a challenge, and I feel like you you faced a challenge. Like, you're not a weak bitch. I feel like somebody, I don't know what they expect. I don't know. <clears throat> Some of you guys could have blocked someone online, or you blocked them from communicating with you through, like, like you know, the connections, the phones, the internet, the whatever. But I feel like there's protection here. You've made the right decision. What's the two of cups? Yeah, three of swords. <laughs> What's two of cups, three of swords? Nine of wands, yeah. Sag, moon, we got Libra, Saturn. So this is either an ex. I just feel like this is a whole bunch of mess here. Third parties, exes, whatever. I feel like now they're all a third party. Your exes, their exes, their exes, exes. Everybody that's in your business. All of you bitches are third parties to this new relationship is what I'm getting. All of you hoes are third parties that are being ignored. <laughs> facts you're a non-factor nobody's sitting around thinking about you hoes you're mad for no reason get over it get over it yeah somebody is happy it's like you're good and a lot of shit is being exposed <laughs> so yeah something has just been an ongoing battle here this is definitely it's like you're expecting trouble. You already have your guards up or this is somebody else's ass. They going through it. What's the three of swords? Somebody's heartbroken or yeah, the eight of cups in reverse. This is somebody here that's stuck. They're faking their happiness. They're insecure. A lot of abandonment wounds coming to the surface for somebody. What's three of cups with the eight of cups reverse? Yeah, the magician. Yeah. So you seeing something clear here. I feel like you kept persevering through something. Something did break your heart. It broke you down. Because somebody here really had you in the third party and they did the most. They did the most here. And I feel like, you know, now that the secret is out or you see something very clear, you don't need... For some of you, if, even if this person hasn't said shit to you, you already see what the fuck going on. They don't have to say shit for you to understand something. You have clarity. Your intuition probably has guided you the whole way through this shit anyways. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> but yeah that's seeing clear this is you manifesting and you see that somebody here is faking their, their happiness with somewhere they're still heartbroken about a third party or this your ex you see that somebody is still a heartbroken ass and they need to go heal or this is you understanding this about your damn self what's the the nine of wands yeah the emperor what's the nine of wands with the emperor Exactly, Emperor to the Empress and the Hierophant in the reverse. <clears throat> Taurus. So yeah, this could be, this connection I feel like is very protected. Okay, this could be something. You and this person live a very alternative lifestyle. You're doing something that's, that's going against societal's norms. This is a very different relationship. This Emperor to the Empress with the Hierophant in the reverse. You're doing something that's causing a lot of uproar and mess and conflict somewhere and i feel like you don't give a fuck that's why the shit is being so protected because this new beginning is causing some mess somewhere else for somebody else and i feel like i feel like these people that put you in third party relationships third party situations with these exes and these bitches that they're hiding or somebody here if your ex here has been lying or um running some sort of smear campaign gossiping about you saying all this shit about you i feel like all that shit's blowing up in a fucking raggedy ass face Okay, and if you were dealing with somebody that <clears throat> you actually had genuine feelings for somebody and they put you in a third, but they didn't tell you about their ex, but they kept being in and out of your life. I feel like they ass that shit getting blown up in their face too. These every last one of these hoes are jealous of you because you're the empress. You're always going to be somebody's always going to be jealous because they look raggedy and they are raggedy. So. These karmic contracts, they're over. 
I feel like you guys could have had some sort of distorted, but you have rose attentive view of the past here, possibly too. You thought that somebody was your person and they're not. It's just a whole bunch of dumbass shit going on. And somebody's getting bad karma for doing all this fucking divination spying, <clears throat> divination spying and all this black ass magic. They're getting karma for that shit too. What's the higher from reverse? Yeah, the chariot. For some of you, your divine masculine is very protected in the spiritual realm. This person here is protecting you and them. And you automatically have protection too, but this person comes with even more protection. They're very valuable. This could be a whole cult, a whole coven of people trying to take y'all down, or this person is just is high ranked spiritually. They can't be fucked with in the spiritual realm. So whatever somebody's trying to do is just that's why somebody's like confused. I don't understand what's going on, bitch. You don't need to. Just know that you're getting ready to get your ass whooped. <laughs> That's all that it is. For some of you, somebody's going to try to argue with you or whatever this is because their life is chaotic. It's a mess. It's out of control. They're confused about why they're not getting no breakthrough. Why shit is falling apart for them. Why they at? They going to spiritual jail. They going to real jail. Things have been revealed. The truth is being seen. You know where you're supposed to be at now. You're planted firmly somewhere or you're going to be and you're not budging for no damn body. This person is getting embarrassed. They feel ashamed or whatever. That's what they get. That's what they get here. What's the higher from the reverse? Yeah, in the chariot. Somebody's going to jail for breaking spiritual law. This is universal law here that somebody has been, somebody's been abusing their power. What's the higher from reverse with the chariot? Or they ask going to real jail. Hopefully it's both. Because I'm sick of seeing y'all bitches come up in readings. What's the higher from reverse with the chariot? Yeah. The seven of souls in reverse. Somebody could actually be on the run. They're trying to avoid going to jail. They don't want to have to deal with this karma. But something has been revealed, though. Somebody's going to the spiritual jail. They're going somewhere for being two-faced. But I feel like this seven of souls in reverse with the chariot, this is you outsmarting your enemy. That's what the fuck you did. Because you're getting some sort of victory with the chariot. <clears throat> you're, you're getting some sort of victory with the chariot. This is you overcoming obstacles, challenges. I feel like this is also your consciousness is kicking in, you turning over a new leaf. And that's exactly what you were supposed to do for you to get this victory. Yeah, Ten of Cups. You're now whole, you're complete, and you're in a divine, faded connection. That's just what it's going to be. So whoever this is right here, they ass is stuck and they going through it. And I feel like that's what the fuck they get for doing this weak-ass, black-ass magic. What's the social media junkie? The Page of Cups. What's social media junkie with the Page of Cups? Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, so somebody admires something that you do online. You can have a lot of secret admirers here online. Some of you guys are getting good news about your finances. You're getting ready to see progress here. Or there's something that you're announcing online. <clears throat> I don't know, but you're really focused on something. I feel like you're getting good news or something like that. There's something that you're committed to. I feel like you've done the inner work here. Or you're still doing the inner work. I mean, inner work is just always. But you've mastered something about yourself. And you're remaining focused. You're a hard worker. Very talented at whatever you do as well. What's the page of cups? Yeah, the four of wands. Okay, wow. Yeah, so some of you guys are announcing a, a, a this could be a pregnancy. Okay. Or um, this could be like a lot of supporters or people that fuck with you with whatever you do for work. <clears throat> But this could be a, an engagement or like a, the birth of a child or you're get, you're getting pregnant or whatever the fuck this is. So congrats. But yeah, yeah, look, the Ace of Cups, a lot of love. A lot of love. Your intuition here is really heightening. This could even be like a date, an offer or something like that. It's just like there's a lot of support. What's the Page of Cups with the Four of Wands? This is you being open to being vulnerable. Some of y'all are in union with your person, just period. Yeah, the page of swords. Somebody's watching you. Be celebrated online with online social media junkie. Are they trying to figure out what the fuck you you getting into? Maybe you're not posting it online, but bitch, here's here's what they're doing. Since you want to know so bad, what you gonna do now? <laughs> like you see what the fuck somebody doing. They minding their motherfucking business. Something that you need to do, ho. 424 on the timer. Like you see what they're doing. They making love to their damn person, they riding some dick. Okay, that just came out like that. Don't beat me up in the comments. That came out like that. 434, four, like they they doing whatever the fuck they want to do, bitch. What the fuck are you saying? What's the page of swords? <laughs> are you in union with the person? Yes. Are you pregnant? Yes, maybe. Are you married? Yes. Is your money looking? Yes, the money is great. 
bitch. What's the what's the page of swords? Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Are you having great sex? Yes. Yes. That's lovely. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Yeah, the temperance. What the fuck? What's the page of swords with the temperance? The devil. Yeah, somebody's obsessed. I feel like you're doing well at transmuting some energy too, but somebody's like obsessed with you. You're a powerful alchemist. You're a healer. You could be healing or whatever, but this is peace and harmony being restored into your life. And somebody's obsessed with what the fuck you're doing. They're obsessed with your life. They're obsessed with where you live at, your children. If you're having great sex, if you're making money or if you're in you, I feel like you are all of that. And a bag of chips. What's the pinnacles? Like, what are you focused on? Bitch, none of your business. What's the Eight of Pentacles, ten of Wands in the reverse. The King of Pentacles. Who are the King of Pentacles? The Page of Wands. Who are the King of Pentacles, Page of Wands? The Two of Swords in reverse. So I feel like, yeah, some lies are being exposed. Something is being revealed about maybe for some of you that somebody's like married. I, this King of Pentacles has been coming out all day. And they ain't really been coming out as somebody that's like a uh, single. They've been coming out as married. I feel like the Ten of Wands is like somebody beating a dead horse or they could not be feeling well or whatever this is. I feel like you're dropping this burden and you're focused. That's what that is. Somebody here is married. This could be somebody too refusing to make a decision or whatever. I feel like maybe somebody financially has to take care of a situation but that's not your problem. I feel like you don't give a fuck about none of that. That ain't got shit to do with you. Just period. For some of you, this King of Pentacles could be somebody that's you, that's your person. They could be, um, there's new exciting plans here between you and this person. You're at peace. You're joyful. You're happy. I feel like somebody's like funny. Your person is very funny. I feel like you're having a good ass time. Two of Swords in Reverse is like revelations. You're not being confused. This could be somebody like, this is like a lot of information coming out, information overload. What's the two of swords in reverse? Okay, yeah. The four of swords in reverse and the knight of pentacles in reverse. Somebody, this is like a lot of mental and emotional turmoil. This knight of pentacles in reverse is still unconscious. They're still sleeping. I feel like they're stressed the fuck out, to be honest. Virgo energy. Somebody is stressed the fuck out. A lot of shit is coming out about this hoe. A lot. This person here is don't have any damn common sense. They're superficial, materialistic. They can't finish what they started. I feel like somebody's stressed. They're stressed the fuck out. A lot of a lot of shit is coming out about somebody. What's the page of wands? Oh, okay. So somebody has some sort of what new plans to 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 bribe people to do something to you or whatever this is. Six Pentacles in reverse. Somebody's losing a job, losing money. They're no longer in a power position and authority, but they try to abuse it. Maybe by what? Getting people to gossip about you? This could be a social climbing ass little bitch here that tried to hex and curse you because of what this bitch is saying. What this King of Pentacles is saying or whatever this is. This this King of Pentacles could be married to this Queen of Pentacles in reverse. <clears throat> okay. So, yeah, you're dropping a zero for a hero. That's what I'm getting. Somebody here is just... I feel like you don't got time for that shit. And you're no longer affected by nobody's fucking spell work. You did the work. So all the spell work is getting ready to back. It's getting ready to bounce off of this person and go right back to you and your delusional ass hoes that you're sitting up here with. Whoever this is, man. Somebody is just so pressed. Everybody's so pressed about your life, what you're doing. They don't have no pot to piss in, no window to throw it up, out of, no fucking money. No nothing. It's like, bitch, you're focused on the wrong fucking thing. This should not, this person should not be a priority. Somebody is lazy. They don't have any work ethic, no goals, no ambition. All this shit is coming out about this bitch. And good. That they're a fucking user. <clears throat> this could be like extortion here. It's like, child, please. The sun. A man holding a heart, period. What else? Definitely a high vibrational masculine this year. What else? The world. Exactly. What else? That's expansion. Okay. The first chakra, Archangel Michael, blossoming abundance, and door to romance. Yeah. Bottom of the deck is fourth chakra, Archangel Raphael. 
Yep. You guys will be seeing three, three, three. Three, five, three could be significant. It might be 29, 45, 35, 33. Somebody could have a one year old. Somebody could be a Leo or an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So, new opportunities and expansion is here. This could definitely be travel. Like your heart this person it's like you were meant for just one person and that's this person that's coming in definitely counterpart energy definitely counterpart energy we got bottom of the deck we got gold material wealth and success hidden gifts high standards spiritual enlightenment self-love and then we got c good plans will bring you success new ideas and possibilities are yours pregnancy and birth of a child or new love period <clears throat> what's the sun Weapons, difficult situations that left an impression. You may need to defend yourself, excuses, traumatic experience, retaliation, and restless. Yeah, so I feel like this is you being free. You free from something. Archangel Michael is here protecting you, or your person here could, could embody Archangel Michael's energy. They're very protective, <clears throat> or they work close to Archangel Michael, or Archangel Raphael, or all of them, <clears throat> all the angels. Somebody here could be being exposed, and now they're there. Somebody, somebody here could be going to to jail, or this is um yeah, because Archangel Michael's on this person's ass. They ass is being exposed. They either could be going to jail, real jail, a spiritual jail, or real jail, um, or people are after this person because they're being exposed for being a fucking liar. They're being exposed. Then we have rainbow turning points, new beginnings, wish fulfillment, dreams manifest, happy endings, good fortune, and rebirth. Some of you guys are having a spare baby. This is a miracle baby. The sun with the rainbow. I'm getting fertility. High fertility. What's the man holding a heart? So we have a uh, knot. Life everlasting. Commitments. Love. Loyalty and love. Independence. Friends. Success and difficult endeavors and freedom. Then we have ladder. Climbing your way to the top. Willingness to grow spiritually. Success. Setting and reevaluating goals. Yeah, you and your person is going to climb your way to the damn top here, period. That was what's intended, and that's what's going to happen with the world. So we got feather. Perseverance, gratitude, peaceful, feeling inspired, freedom, success, reminder to slow down and enjoy life. So yeah, this is you. I feel like some of you guys could be seeing feathers here. You could be seeing rainbows. But I feel like this is you traveling. <clears throat> With your person, you and this person get ready to travel like a lot. Definitely towards Libra energy here with the three. Yeah, under a man holding a heart. Yeah. Then we have four leaf clover. More comfortable life ahead. Money, security, success, joy, personal gain, and success and career, period. Yeah, there's there's some definitely getting ready to expand. What's first chakra? Archangel Michael. So we have violence here, devotion and dedication, nourishment, joyful home, good relationships, love, new love of people and projects and manifesting and torch on. Attracting attention from suitors, recognition in life, promotion, ideas, hard work will be rewarded and happy. Yes, Archangel Michael is here protecting your ass. Ain't nobody going to come in here and try to fuck up something. Not again. I feel like they've been doing that shit with their weak ass. Yeah, what's blossoming abundance? We have staff here. Your dreams are being supported. Divine connection with God and the universe. Yeah, power, wisdom, purpose, and knowledge. And that's right under a man holding a heart. Your purpose is to be with whoever this is. Maybe you haven't met them yet, but they're coming. Or to work with this person or whatever. Whatever your dreams are with this person, it's going to manifest. Then we have balloon. Letting go. Independence, party, freedom, celebration, happiness, childhood, holding on to hope and joy. <clears throat> yeah you and somebody can have a really playful relationship okay what's daughter romance we have coin productivity success duality spiritual peace health harmony pay raise promotion and recognition and then we have bible here that bible card been coming out all day protection knowledge safety community divinity healing reflection guidance love and truth yeah 
Something really getting ready to happen with your money too. Your your money is getting ready to look really, really good. You and Miss Persons. Yeah. So this is your reading, Pisces. I hope this reading gave you clarity. Like, comment, subscribe. Excuse me. Turn your notification bell on. Press the all button. So you won't miss my reads. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.